now weather with meteorologist Elisa Rafa. Good morning. We're starting out with a dense fog advisory this morning for central Missouri. It goes from Nevada through Lake of the Ozarks and then towards Walla. This one goes until 10 o'clock this morning for some fog developing with less than a quarter mile visibility. Again, a reminder, we've had this uh, pretty much all week. But uh, just to uh, remember, it, take it slow on the roads with that visibility low. Use those headlights and leave space between you and the car in front of you. We're down to a mile visibility in Clinton, a half a mile in Rawa. There is still some patchy fog around Springfield and then even down towards Branson. A quarter mile of visibility there. Temperatures are above freezing this morning. It's 43 degrees in Springfield. Uh, so that's at least good news because we do have rain moving through this morning. So with temperatures in the 40s, we're not concerned about any icing. Uh, a lot of the rain is down to about a drizzle uh, from Springfield down to Branson and Ava. We do have some heavier showers over around Texas County near Houston and then over towards Mountain View and West Plains. Uh, we'll see these showers continue to push east and exit as we head through mid-morning. Uh, we'll have a drier second half of the day. Uh, we've got this low pressure that is uh, centered over Oklahoma That's and this front that's draped across the Ozarks. That's what's bringing in uh, the showers here this morning. Rain chances, though, will drop significantly by about noon. I don't expect rain later on today, so you need the umbrellas this morning, but you won't need them through the rest of the afternoon. Showers push to the east by about 11 a.m. However, we do keep the clouds thick through the afternoon, so temperatures hold steady. We're looking at upper 30s to the north, low to middle 40s from Springfield and areas to the south, which is about where we are right now. So temperatures don't really budge all too much today. We keep mostly cloudy skies overnight tonight. Temperatures drop to 35. We keep mostly cloudy skies again tomorrow with temperatures in the low to middle 40s. Then by tomorrow night, we start to have rain arrive across the Ozarks. And this is the start of that weekend winter storm that we've been talking about all week. So if we time some of this out for you, we're looking at dry, cloudy, and breezy conditions on Friday. Rain starts to arrive on the overnight. Notice all these greens. That's rain for much of the Ozarks overnight Friday into Saturday morning. Then cold air comes in quick by Saturday morning. You see all these lines, how close they are? That's showing us that these pressure gradients are really tight, which means that winds are going to be very gusty. So the cold air comes in uh, pretty much with these very gusty winds that transitions all of the rain to snow, and we'll have uh, these wind gusts 30 to 35 to maybe even 40 miles per hour. We transition to snow by Saturday morning through Saturday afternoon. All of the snow exits to the east by Saturday night, and then in comes this Arctic high pressure, which is going to continue to spill in the cold. But notice the high pressure now lifts to the north and to the east. It doesn't really come over the Ozarks. So that will still bring us cold, but maybe not as cold as we were expecting. So some of the threats with this, with this rain Friday night, some of it could be locally heavy. We've had some flooding issues the last couple of weeks, so there is a limited flooding threat to the south and east where we could get one to one and a half inches of rain there. Risk of two inches or more of snow, more or less haven't changed at a low end threat for two inches in Springfield. Higher as you go towards central Missouri might have to keep monitoring this, but we're looking at uh, light accumulations about one to two inches across the Ozarks. We still get that cold air to come in, only 27 on Sunday. But again, maybe not as cold as we were expecting because that cold air kind of comes in, comes out pretty quick. A kickoff at uh, Kansas City at Arrowhead for that game. Uh, still with temperatures in the teens. You still need layers. It will uh, still feel sub zero to single digits. Maybe not as close to that coldest kickoff at one degree. 44 today. Showers early and steady temperatures with clouds later. 36 overnight, mostly cloudy. 47 tomorrow, mostly cloudy, breezy. Rain arriving late. It transitions to snow on Saturday.